I'm, I'm curious about this city that I live in, St. Louis, and it's, uh, it's had some historical important moments, but it seems to be at a place where it's kind of, uh, I don't know, run down. It's not, not that great of a place, but there's a lot of, we have rivers here. We have, you know, a lot of, it's, it's the center of this continent to some degree. Could you, could you talk about, is there potential for this actual physical place here of St. Louis? Absolutely. The fact that it is surrounded by the beauty of the natural world that you have described indicates that it too possesses a great deal of natural beauty that perhaps just hasn't been cultivated by the occupants of the city, but it still exists as a dormant potential nevertheless. So through different types of energetic workings, through different types of blessings, and through different types of shamanic workings with the land and the neighboring energy centers, all types of positive vibrations and energies can be introduced into the collective consciousness of the city. And this will enable that natural beauty, that natural creativity, that natural love that exists within the hearts of all people that occupy it to become more overt, to begin to awaken. So you understand the phrase, if you wish to see a change in your world, you must be the change yourself. And as you begin to explore your own natural relationship with beauty, with love, and you blend that with the earth and the power centers of the earth that are proximal to you in the city, it automatically ripples. Because fundamentally, you are all one being. There's many names for this being, God, source, all that is. You are all this. You all contain this within you. Therefore, even though the forms and the personas may be different, the underlying life force, that original level that exists within all of you, is identical, exactly the same. So as you make a change within yourself, because you are all beings that you experience, it means on a certain level, all other beings that you experience have made that change, whether they consciously recognize it or not.